NHS art students are giving back to the community through a brand new project called the Empty Bowls Project. Student Sarah Barnell says she's enjoying the painting and design part. Um, I went for a pastel theme, like right now I'm painting like lilac, and I don't know if it's actually going to turn out pastel, but like, who knows? The empty bowls were made from clay and then fired in the kiln as part of the glazing process. Barnell says you never know exactly how the colors are going to look after they come out of the oven. Kind of like a surprise, because uh, you kind of see how the bowls turn out, like from when they were in their clay form, and then when they come out from the kiln, you're not going to like know exactly what the colors are going to show up as. Freshman Maddie Gruber says she enjoys creating the bowls, especially the last few steps of the process. And right now we're in the glazing process, which is where you cover it with a thing called glaze. It's made out of glass and water, and as the art teachers keep repeating, it's purely science. The Empty Bowls Project is a collaboration between the Art Stinks Club and the Art Honor Society, with the benefit going to the Nord Food Pantry. Art teacher Laura Mead McGrory says students have been talking about doing this for a while. This year, the beginning of the year, we were we got together with Art Sangs and Art Honor, and we asked kids like, "What do you want to do?" It's also an opportunity for people to like make stuff and then sell stuff and help other people in the process. Students say that after the glazing, the bowls will be totally functional and ready to be used with real food. Where we are selling these small bowls for five dollars and the larger bowls for. And so all the proceeds are going to go to the Norwood Food Pantry. Mead McGorry says that more than 50 bowls have been designed and she's proud of the students for taking on a meaningful project. Um, we just want to make sure that it comes from the students and not from the top down, ooh, we're teachers, we are going to make you do this. Um, that it's actually something that the students find interesting and valuable. And now that the project is wrapping up, students say they're excited to see the final products and get the sale underway. Um, I'm looking forward to looking at all the bowls and like the other students work and you know just everyone's different so it's not like a mass produced item, it's like unique. The empty bowls will be for sale at the art show in the NHS library on March 11th from 5.30 to 7pm and then again at the cultural night on March 12th in the cafeteria. Any leftover bowls will be available in May at the Fine Arts Festival. Reporting for Mustang Magazine, I'm Juliana O'Neill.